on blue side, left side. Jesse, caveman. Thanks. Yo, 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 it is caveman, the one and only. Legendary. Uh, they started off quick. First 30 second goal to uh, NDSU. Hoping to see a lot of uh, productivity in these series here. You got a good save by Raw. Good clear. Looks like NDSU is trying to play off the roof. Trying to bring it in, but uh, Dunwoody is keeping the pressure on. Uh, Dunwoody gets slammed again by NDSU. Swamp Monkey coming in. Swamp Donkey. Swamp Donkey. Starting off a minute in. Three minutes, 53 times, zero to two, Dunwoody. Rob bringing it down, down orange side. Immediately gets taken out of the sky by NDSU. This is very early this is game one in the best of five series. Avalanche giving oh. a good good pass right down mid. Avalanche trying to get to secure, but uh, Ikrix uh, defends that. Avalanche trying to make a play. Dunwoody definitely has to get it off of their side of the field. NDSU is doing a lot of pressure right now. Good takeaway by Avalanche. Yeah, NDSU with a lot of shots on goal this first match. True. <clears throat> Frostbite taking it back down on orange side. NDSU is rebuttaling. See, Frostbite can get the ball. Oh, he hits it 50 50 right up to the top. Let's see if Rock can make anything of it. Oh, quick pass through mid. Goes right over too quickly for Ra to be able to put it in. Now we're on Dunwoody's side. Dunwoody got finagled all over the place. They got bumped, bumped everywhere. This one. Now 3-0, NDSU. Still plenty of time, 2.34 time. Here goes Raw, trying to deflect it back out of the mid. NDSU putting it right back in mid, past it, a little high up on the, le on the left. Decent clear from Dunwoody. Dunwoody, oh, Raw just barely misses the ball. It's going to be rough. He has no boost as well. Frostbite taking off the roof. Pass it to Avalanche. Avalanche tried to get it, get it in there, but he does not have much boost. Ooh, good shot on goal. Saved by Greek Avenger. <laughs> Avalanche loses that fight, and it's off the top. Very close goal. And there's another one off the top. Super close goals. Dunwoody needs to get it out of their side of the field. Minute 30 left. 0-3. They need to make some momentum. Get something working. Seems as though NDSU is at every moment right in midfield, being able to win out on every 50-50 so far. Crossbite's bringing it down middle, gets deflected off the top. One minute left, see what they can do.
Avalanche trying to get the ball out of the corner, is unable to. NDSU all over there, all over the place. Oh, big reset, but no follow-up from NDSU. Hopefully we can get a goal here. Avalanche gets deflected with 50 up. Raw trying to get up there with what little boost he's working with. He doesn't have much. They need they got 25 times. Oh, it was almost a goal there. I don't think they're gonna have uh, this first game. 0-4, 15 times, Swamp Donkey puts it in for the fourth goal for NDSU. This is probably a wrap for game one. Dunwoody's really backpedaling, they're really on their, on their heels right now, this whole game. It all started with that first goal, 20, 28 seconds in. Yeah, this is a tough first match for the Hawks. So, let's put it together. I don't know what NDSU is trying to do there. Game one goes to NDSU. Tough first match for the Big. Hawks. We'll take it as a warm up. Yeah, first match every time is a warm-up match, no matter what game you're playing, either it be competitive or non-competitive. It's always a warm-up match. Especially in Rocket League, every match is a warm-up match, in my opinion. Believe me, I got 400 hours, and I still feel like I'm in a warm-up match every time. I just happened to do a match before this for the first time in a long time, and I ended up winning, scoring and winning, so I'm going to retire now. There you go. You got a goal on your belt and you don't need any more. Nope. One and done. You did. You played the game. You did Rocket League. I so did you can officially retire as the best Rocket League player out there. One goal. Yeah, my, my reflexes aren't what they used to be. Oh, that is correct for me as well. Especially if you're trying to play in first person shooters. It's starting to sway away from me. You know, there's a CS, uh, no, CSGO player who's like 83 years old over in Europe. And he's, uh, he won some big, some world championship over there. Yeah, I don't exactly know what. But... Yeah, there's some uh, there's some old guy streamers that are on there on uh, Twitch that uh, they they do uh, like Battlefield or Fortnite. Starting off game two, series is 1-0 NDSU. NDSU's already putting on the pressure. The goal, first 15 seconds in, or with a, a goal attempt. Let's see if uh, Avalanche can set it up. Oh, and he gets thwarted. Ekrux is coming in. Oh, looks like NDSU actually stole that from his teammate. Yeah. Probably a little miscommunication on their end. Oh, and that's going right in. It is, oh, that was super close by Frostbite, but unfortunately we can't do anything about that. It was a 106 kilometer per hour uh, shot there. It's really difficult to defend those shots, especially with having about 30 boost. 420 time, plenty of time, 0-1, game two. NDSU is up, 1-0, the series. Crossbite uh, just dis disrupts that pass there. Has no boost, and this is the ball just barely. Avalanche trying to pick it up. Fortunately, he's out of boost as well. They're very boost starved right now on Dunwoody's side. Back over to Dunwoody's uh, side of the field. Dunwoody needs to get it out of there. They did a double commit there, which is a little scary. <coughs> Cross by trying to make a play, and he does the the eight, the old double backflip, the old backflip action. I do that so many times in every game I do. Every game I play, I always try and do the double jump and do a back pedal. Oh, so much slop right in front of NDSU. Oh, big hit right back mid. Get sent back into the corner. 
Oh, big pop-up by NDSU. Gets right over at Frostbite. Another big hit. Oh, and a double touch off the top. EQ came, brings it in with the uh, double touch off top of the goal. Alright. 0 2 3 10 time. Still plenty of time. There's always plenty of time in Rocket League. You can score a goal within 5 seconds. DSU trying to make a play off the wall. Gets disrupted by Raw. Oh, and a minor miss there. Greek Avengers looking to disrupt. Slows the ball down and clears it. He's looking for a play. Oh, and he barely misses. It's a good shot on goal, but if he was able to have just a little more boost, he would have gotten another goal on his uh, belt. Avalanche getting taken out by Greek Avenger. EQ's trying to get a goal in off of that demolition. Does not happen. Raw does get a save for that. EQ's looking for a good goal here off the top. He's looking for a double, and he can't put it down. Oh, big redirect. Great from EQ to Swamp Donkey. Goal number three for NDSU. Seems as though NDSU is everywhere and anywhere all at once. And any time that Dunwoody's he's trying to bring the ball down the field, there is NDSU player just weak, just lurking. Yeah, they seem to be everywhere. They've got stellar communication. It's like... Yeah, they got really good rotates, most likely really good communication going for uh, NDSU. Oh, big pop up towards mid. Oh, and it gets disrupted again. All right, we're on Dunwoody's side again. It gets up on top. It's a big, oh, it's a good deep redirect there. Oh, they, they, they got to get some momentum behind that ball. I think one big thing that Dunwoody's having issues with right now is having boost. They're getting really boost starved. I think NDSU is playing really good at uh, taking all of the boost from Dunwoody. Cumulatively right now, they, they have like zero boost for all of their uh, all done what he players. It was a good defend there by Vra. Oh, they need to get that ball out of there. It's a good clear, good clear. And a miss by Ra. Good good look for Avalanche. The Green Avengers there to take take the goal away from him. Another good look by Frostbite, but EQ's there to take care of that as well. We got big plays coming up from NDSU in the corner. Dunway's got to figure out a way to disrupt it as any means possible. We're gonna see a wall play right off the wall. EQ's looking for the double. Oh, he got the reset just in time to redirect in the top left corner of the goal. That is goal number four for NDSU. It's 4 nothing currently. 28 time for Dun... Oh, and then they get... Gets, uh, the Swamp Donkey gets the slow play on him. Dribbles around him. Makes it seem like he's going to do something. Let's him commit and then secures the goal for goal number five. All it, all, all it takes is about five seconds. It was 28 time and then it was 23 time. It takes about five seconds to score a goal. About 15 time, we're gonna probably seal game number two for NDSU. Right over Raw. Raw had the weird jump up on the corner. I think the Hugs have kind of given up this game at this point. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on there. Uh, there's gotta be a huge communication divide. I mean, people are probably really salty. It's probably really cold right now for them to really get anything going. It's a good spot to be in. Yeah, we'll Avalanche at least gets on the board with one goal for the series. It's not gonna help out very much. 
They got two seconds left to try and score a minimum of five. Wrap it up for game two. See if they can bring that momentum into game three. Love this worst we're seeing from both sides too. Yeah, it's highly unfortunate. I don't know what's going on with Dunwoody, but uh, they that nothing's firing right now. Seems like they have a seize motor in each one of their cars right now. They they they're not able to communicate, not able to get the rotates down. NDSU is just everywhere and anywhere all at one time. I think we're gonna take a little bit of a breather here. They're probably conversing as to what happened in the last two games. Try and regain their composure and come back. This could be match point. We'll see what happens. I think we're going yep, to Dunwoody will have to win the next three games to be able to take the series. We are learning a lot here. Immediately Raw gets Swamp Donkey down. That doesn't help him too much because the ball is already going on Dunwoody's side. Raw's trying to bring up the ball, gets deflected back on Dunwoody's side. Frostbite is trying to work his best with the ball right now. Just consistently, one after another, Dunwoody is just finding an NDSU in their face every time they have the ball. Oh, it's a good look here, and it gets deflected off the top. Greek Avenger had a really good uh, play there to disrupt the ball pass off the top. Oh, and we got a good good goal, good first goal of the game. 1-0, uh, 420 time. Avalanche saw a hole and took it. Let's see if they can keep this going, 420 time. one nothing. series is 2-0 NDSU. Big boot off the top. Oh, and that was a scary one right there. He could have gotten that one in, snuck it in, but he just barely missed the ball. Raw's looking to disrupt the play. Unable to. Ball gets carried away. Ooh, great save there. Frostbite bringing it to the other end. Trying to follow the ball. The ball gets a wicked bounce off the corner. Raw keeps the ball in play. Trying to make a make a point. Uh, team's not there to help him out. Been done what he said now. Big takeaway. EQ had a big takeaway there. Raw trying to make a play. It's a good toss up right in mid. Nobody's there to help him. Got a big uh, demo by Frostbite. See if they can secure it. And Avalanche brings the ball in for another another goal. We're up 2-0. Yep. They definitely executed a play well as soon as they saw that they took out one of the players. Oh, there's nobody in goal. A lot of slop in the corner. Oh, big boom play by Swamp Donkey in the corner. Two to one, three minutes time. See if, if Frostbite can make a play for mid. He's out of boost. Raw's looking. He's looking, but Dun uh, NDSU brings it right over to the other corner. Avalanche trying to bring the ball down mid. Big 50 for NDSU. It's a pretty big ball coming in right at the goal, and it's a 
Near miss. Top right corner. Crossbite's trying to bring the ball back over to the NDSU side. Instantly gets met with Swamp Donkey. Raw with a big play on oh, just misses the ball. Big demo by Greek Avenger. Doesn't when he's trying to apply the pressure, but we got a big ball coming in. Oh, just misses left side. Avalanche gets the save for that one. Ball is up. Crossbite misses the ball. And Avalanche gets taken out. So there is a free goal for Swamp Dunks. Yeah, highly unfortunate that Frostbite missed that ball. If he would have hit that ball, it would have made a difference. Good send over to NDSU. Raw's trying to make a play. Give it to Aval give it to Frostbite. Frostbite misses. Avalanche sends it flying towards the goal. Ooh, just a slight touch by Avalanche. And a demo on Swamp Donkey. Let's see if they can bring that momentum in and get a goal number three. Ooh, big, big, big. Just one defender. Oh, too much playing around with the ball. Here comes the ball. Oh, that's a big setup for NDSU, and that's a goal by Swamp Donkey. Yeah. Those slow, high-falling balls right in the middle, right in front of the goal, are always the scariest. I can never calculate what's going on when that ball is just having hang time of forever in front of the goal. Oh, almost a goal on NDSU by their own player. Luckily enough, he was able to get it out in his corner. Big bump action by Raw. See if Frostbite can defend, get through the defenders. Of course, does not. Oh, big bounce plays back and forth between Raw and Avalanche. That was good pass there. Clinical textbook work. Match three. We're tied up three to three. Dogs can put one more win and send it to a match four. Big stop in mid. So Dunwoody's trying to make a play happen in 20 seconds. They cannot allow that ball to get in in 20 seconds. I'd much rather see him in overtime get scored on in the last 15. Oh, big play. Big play by Raw and Avalanche again. They're just clicking on full cylinders now. Yeah, they had a couple warm-up games. Now they're ready to go. 4-3-13 time. That's still plenty of time for NDSU to rebuttal. Oh, big defend right in mid for the first touch. Gotta keep that ball down. NDSU is going to look to try and tie it up for overtime. Now we are, uh, the series is 2-1. to one. Uh, NDSU 2, Dunwoody 1. I'm going to hop into their comms quick. I'll be right back. You got it. I didn't want their comms on. <coughs> We've got a series now. That is, that is correct. We uh, finally seen Dunwoody uh, heat up. And, get, and they're going into game four now. They're psyched. They're positive, too. 
good. They, they got that momentum going for themselves. Should be able to uh, secure the next game, next two games, as long as they keep playing the way they're playing. Frostbite trying to get the wall bounce. Unfortunately, not there to get it. Avalanche playing the ball. He only has one defender left to defeat. That one defender does send the ball back. Wicked bounce. Avalanche tries to negate the, the goal. Oh! Frostbite is almost there. The very slow ball. That is highly unfortunate. Four thirty seven times, zero one in DSU. Something tells me NDSU does not want to win this, uh, does not want to lose this game. Yeah, they don't want to win this game, right? NDSU doesn't want to win this game. They got their first two wins, and then they're just going to give it to them, right? That's, that's what I'm meaning. Definitely. Oh, big shot. Oh, EQ's there to save it. Raw trying to make something in the corner with Avalanche. Avalanche, or Frostbite's bringing it in, and it gets punted back to the Dunwoody side. <laughs> yeah. Avalanche playing the ball off the wall. Pretty decent setup for NDSU though. Frostbite's there to deflect and get the save. Avalanche is down for three seconds. And just enough time for Swamp Donkey to get the goal number two. That was one thing a lot of my friends hated when uh, first, we all first started playing uh, Rocket League when it first came out is all I knew how to do was demo people. And demo them a lot, I did. Yeah, but like when you're when you're in a friendly game and all that stuff, uh, trends don't take kindly <laughs> to being demoed 12 times in a game. <laughs> I don't think anybody would take kindly to being demoed. So I'm not... I'm, I'm not all that great at the game, so I did what I could do best, which is Troy. Oh, big save by Raw. Avalanche does take out Greek Avenger, but that doesn't give him really too much time. Greek Avenger's back up now. Raw's trying to get the ball out of the corner. Big hit right in the mid. Frostbite does clear it. Ball's coming right back. It is set up for mid. Oh, they both miss. Frostbite trying to get the ball out. Unfortunately, not able to get it out. Still in the corner. EQ's making a big play towards mid. Sends a little too much sauce on the ball. Avalanche trying to make a play, and some reason the ball just kind of tipped over into the corner there. Again, Dunwoody's pretty much out of boost. They need to figure out something there. They're boost, uh, they're, they've been boost star for a while. I think that was one thing uh, that happened in the last game is uh, Dunwoody was able to get their get their boost plots way more easily than uh, this game. Which they do get a ball in. Raw does get get the ball in for Avalanche assist. Big boot right down mid. There's nothing that NDSU could do about it. 12, uh, 2 16 time. 1 to 2 NDSU. Was it was right there. Greek Avenger was waiting for him, and he takes out Frostbite. This is gonna be a two-person for another second. Light hit towards mid. Frostbite's bringing it in. Oh, so close. Frost got the ball. Applying a lot of pressure. Right up on top, mid, top. Oh, in. Frostbite trying to get it in, but Swamp Donkey's there. Avalanche tried doing it again. Unfortunately, was not able to connect. Good bump by Frostbite to, to disrupt the play. Raw trying to bring the ball back up. Takes uh, NDSU's boost. Oh, pop up over Frostbite. That's a little scary. Avalanche is there to secure the save. Avalanche playing off the wall. Not enough boost. Oh, 
So close. So, so many close shots. Minute 10 left. One to two. Here comes the big ball coming in. Nice and slow. Oh, it's a floater. EQ does take out Avalanche. Avalanche is down for another second. Dunway's got 51 time left. I gotta get at least a goal and bring it in overtime. <clears throat> Avalanche to Raw. Raw's trying to make a play. Greek Avenger does disrupt that play. EQ's trying to make a play as well. Nope, not anymore. Here comes Raw off the top. It's a big play towards mid, and it gets disrupted by EQ. EQ's looking to try and get a goal when there's nobody there. Unfortunately, he's not able to get that in. And there's a goal coming Great. in. Frostbite gets the save. 19 time. 1 to 2. Dunway's got to make something. 13. We're at final 10 seconds. Dunwoody's got to put something in. NDSU side. Oh, big, oh, big man. hit. Oh, and Frostbite. Oh, that was so close. Very, very Avalanche close. was so close. And it looks like this is going to be going to NDSU. Next week, I'm just going to analyze this and figure out what we need to improve in. Yeah, what I've noticed a lot of is uh, NDSU was hogging all of the boosts everywhere. Yes. And Dunwoody was not able to have any type of boost. They they were relying on the small boost plots, not the 100% ones in the corner. It would be very difficult to uh, do anything with little to no boost. Very much so. Well, thanks for joining in. We'll be back Sunday with uh, CS2, actually, which you'll, you'll get to see your very own caveman playing that. Yeah, I'll be in that game. We'll see how that goes. I'll be in that game. <laughs> uh, so we will not be having him cast unless he thinks he can do both. Oh, I'll do both. I'll jump back both. and forth. How about that? Every time I die, which will be every round, I'll be in here. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> GG's. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for joining me, Jesse. Uh, and we will be back next week. Pleasure.